Hello everybody, and what? what the hell? I started the recording, and I even started talking, and I didn't mean to, and I don't really know what I even mean by that. Anyways, hello everybody, we're playing Turbo Mode again. Let's go for it. Oh my god, the breach looks so good. I love it, it's amazing. Anyways, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna keep on heading. I think we completed one of these, so let's go and uh, get some stuff. Hey, thank you. And let's go. Right, let's see what we end up getting. Uh, I'll go and spend some of my hegemony credits. I need to get some more hegemony credits going. I've not got many right now. But I will, yet again, spend them all at this machine. We got the burr to start with. I'm not happy with that. The glacier is better. Hey, and a key. That's what I like to see. I like to see a key for me. But yeah, welcome back to the modded, mega modded series. We are jumping... Into the breach, into the breach, into the gungeon once again, and seeing what we might start with. We've had some pretty interesting runs recently. That last one was a lot of fun. I did unfortunately perish due to my own idiocy. Um, but this time, this time won't be the case. Oh, but when we started with uh, the frost giant and we got the glacier, which is pretty interesting, but also Lichy Trigger Finger. Very, very, very good item to start with. I really like the Lichy Trigger Finger, it's one of my favorite B tiers. Um, fire rate is just fun. Fire rate is just fun. And yeah, Frost Giant here. Not a particularly good weapon in my opinion. But um, early game, it's actually pretty good. I think normally you end up... I, I end up finding it like late game. And by then it's normally pretty useless. Because the ammo count on it is just too low. But early game like this, pretty damn good. I like it. Especially when you can do some freezing and some insta-killing. I like it. Die, hand. Shop here already. Also, Turbo Mode here, which is great. Hello, Chompy Loy. Table Tech Heat, Table Tech Null, Table Tech Shotgun. I would quite like to buy every single one of them. Every single damn one. One second. Ah, oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's continue onwards. My bad. But yeah, early game, I actually kind of like it. It's pretty decent. It's doing a good job. And like I said, if we stand close, we get the extra little puffy freeze effect, which is good. Which is very, very good. Very, very nice. But yeah, we didn't actually start with any modded items, which is kind of a rarity nowadays. I mean, Equilibrium does make it so that um, the, the mod that essentially balances all the weights of all the modded items. It also balances the weight of vanilla items as well, I think. So you'll see an equal distribution of vanilla items to modded items also. So we might see a few more vanilla items than usual, which is a really, 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 really good and important thing in my opinion. Because I think one thing that, um, I, I don't know if it's specifically been forgotten, but one thing that might not have been considered or might not have been really uh, thought about a, a ton is when uh, mods such as Once More Into the Breach add 5,000 new guns, which is pretty awesome because they're all great, but it adds a lot of new guns and stuff. And of course, when you have even more mods on top of Once More Into the Breach, there's even more. It adds all these, which is all well and good, but pretty much all of them, also Devolver Around's pretty sad, but pretty much all of them rely on vanilla guns to enable their synergies. There is a few where it's cross-mod synergies, but a lot of them rely on vanilla weaponry to uh, enable their synergies, which means that... When you've, when you've not got Equilibrium on and you're finding a ton of modded items and very few vanilla items, you don't really see that many synergies. And there is some really, really good and interesting synergies out there in modding. I know for a fact that in Once More Into the Breach, Never Names Mod, he's actually introduced a few custom forms uh, for uh, synergies. So yeah, it, it'd be really sad to see like a situation where you couldn't really find those. Now we've got a little battery here. I don't know what this does. I can never remember. I've had it a few times before, but I don't remember what it does. Um, charges your active item upon room clear. Okay, interesting. We don't have an active item right now, but that could be kind of good. Right, we'll see what rewards we get from you, and that'll base my decision on my purchases. I kind of want to get some table techs. I don't think I can afford any more than one, but I might get like table tech null. I'm not quite sure what the null one does, but I'd like to find out. I probably do know what it does. I just don't remember. Um, but... If I get a key from this guy, then I might buy a key and go down to the sewers. We'll see what this guy ends up dropping us. I really like the Glacier. I remember when the Glacier was, like, insanely overpowered. Anyone remember that? We also got the, um... 
build a gun. And we already got a synergy with it. Hey, bullet modifier devolver. Okay. Nice. Right, so. What can we afford from you? So we could get... Damn. Wait, eh... Uh... No, we don't have enough for two of these. I'd, I'd probably get these two if I had enough, but I'll just buy this one instead. Let's get gone. I can't remember what table tech null does. Let's see if I can find out. Of course, I teleport to a room with no tables in it. No tables. No tables. God damn it, game. If you could give me a single table just to try this out, that'd be neat. I have literally no idea. Maybe the description will give me a better description. Um, Ancient Table Tech allows users to vaporize enemies' bullets from thin air as if they never existed. So it's Table Tech blank, but worse? <laughs> we'll see. I don't know how it works yet. It sounds like it's going to be similar to Table Tech blank. Um, but like, I, it says vaporize them. I don't know how close they have to be for that to do its thing. It might end up being better than Table Tech blank. I don't know. It seems similar though. Either way. I suppose Table Tech blank's a bit better because it can trigger... Um, on blank effects, like amulets. I doubt this is going to trigger an amulet effect. But still, we are happy with it nonetheless. And it costed more than the others, so it ought to be good. Uh, cat's eye. I don't know what the cat's eye does. So we got um, bullet modifier devolve on this thing. I don't exactly know what that means, but this weapon doesn't seem all that good so far. I wasn't expecting it to be great. Oh god. <laughs> This damn room. Why does this room still exist, Nevenim? God damn. Okay. Ooh, I see, actually. I seem to be firing arrows every now and again. That's kind of nice. But actually, that room wasn't so bad. That room wasn't so bad. I take back my earlier comment. It just... It's massive, so I, I start crying inside. But it's not actually that bad. Traversing it's a little bit annoying. But other than that, it's fine. It looks really funny on your minimap as well. Oh god, it actually devolved him, but it devolved him into a giant. It's kind of funny. Um, Frost Giant, we can get some ammo for you. Frost Giant will be good for another few floors. I absolutely love those barrels. Boom, that's so fucking cool. Such a good job with us. It's a shame they're gonna have to be manually placed in custom rooms and you can't like have some sort of replacement method for them. So it'd be cool to see those in more rooms, but I don't really know the best way that you'd manage or balance that. I'll be completely honest. Oh, we need to use our table thing as well. We've not really been using it yet. We do indeed have a nice golden chest there. I'll very much be opening that if I can get myself a key. We've got enough to buy them from the shop already. Oh, I love the freezing effect on big enemies like that. Enemies that kind of, they're like the centerpiece of a room. Eh. Seems interesting, I guess. I, I imagine it has some cool synergies as well. It seems pretty useful, to be fair. Um, but in general, flipping the table itself is going to block the bullet. So it maybe needs a, like a wider radius around it, perhaps. I might just be using it wrong. I feel like a lot of the time um, when I have a complaint or an issue with an item, it's because my, my feeble brain doesn't actually understand how to use it. So, Bunny, feel free to tell me how wrong I am and how big of a doo-doo head I am. Because I probably am. It's probably quite likely. Either that, or it maybe is an earlier item from the uh, from the mod that doesn't have as much to it as some of the other ones. Which, that's fine. Basic items are actually a good thing. I think having items that are bad or, like, not super complex is a good thing, because yeah, you don't need every single item in your pack to be something crazy and over the top. Which, I do think Bunny has some amazing ones like that. But yeah, I'm fine to have some more basic ones as well. Doing a lot better on turbo mode this time than we were last time. I feel like I've learned it a little bit. Um, I think Glacier can put this out. Yeah. I might not even be able to get a key to actually open that, but 
at least it's um at least it's not gonna blow up. I do not know what this is. Lich's old gun, and we have a synergy with it as well. The synergy being who knows? It just didn't tell us for some reason. Lich's old gun. It just doesn't care to tell us. It's because it doesn't have a synergy. Wait. What? Okay, this is confusing. The Lich's old gun weathered with time. This gun might not shoot, but its strong magic energy provides useful So now Wait a minute. Does this give all synergies to all other weapons? Or something along that line. I don't know. What mod is this from? I'm very confused. It doesn't even say what mod it's from. What the hell? One moment. Okay, I have requested... I have requested the uh, the boys in the Discord tell me what it does. Because right now I'm... I don't really know. Doesn't shoot. Maybe I throw it? I can't even throw it. It has one ammo and it doesn't shoot, but... I thought it'd maybe, like, give synergies to all my weapons. Maybe it'll work with future weapons. Maybe weapons that I get in the future it'll work with. Maybe if I drop this and pick it back up. No? I'm really not quite sure. Right, anyways, let's do the boss. Um, I think it's special API stuff. Um, it's literally eye bullets, but for passive items. Oh. Oh. I see. I I got really confused there. I, I see now. So, basically, Lichy eye bullets is a passive item that gives all guns their synergy. And the Lichy, uh, the, the Lichy's old pistol, old gun, is a gun that gives all passive items all of their synergies. I see. Okay. Well, this is going to be a lot more confusing because I don't know what synergy some things have. Um, but we'll we'll see how it goes. It seems like it's a really cool idea. I completely forgot that Lichy Eye Bullets give synergies to guns, not passives. That's where my confusion mainly came from. I was completely getting it wrong which way around it is. So, right now I don't think we have any really great... Um, passive item synergies, but I think in the future we're going to have a few good ones. I'd like to get uh, a passive item from this floor if I can. There you go. If you give me a key, that'd be solid. Hey, give me a key. And we also got the execution shells. I never remember what they do. Gasoline. Yeah, so we got synergies for gasoline now. Hmm. Quite spicy. Quite spicy. This is going to be a lot of fun. We want to be buying up as many passive items as we possibly can. This run could get wacky. I am going to have literally no idea what the vast majority of the synergies we are getting are doing. So be prepared for that. I, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to be pretty much in the dark for the most part. Uh, do we get any additional stats from Lichy Eye Bullets? I can't tell. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Okay, gasoline is doing some things. I'm guessing that's part of the synergy with gasoline there. Ammo is very nice for us here. These enemies I have to kill? Yes, they are. What the hell? Gasoline. <laughs> I'm guessing that's part of the synergy, because that is filling up the entire room with fire. Y'all like your frame rate drops? Hope y'all like frame rate dropping. Yeah. 
There we go. Set ourselves up nicely for some kills on the enemies that spawn directly in here. Ow. Keep her going. Hey, mushroom bro. Can barely see where the enemies are spawning in. Is there more than one? Apparently. It'd be funny if each piece of the totem created the fire. Do to just crawl into this fire real quick? There you go. Right, shop time. Seashell. I will buy it. It did not have synergies. Very saddening. Um, active items automatic. Uh, activates active. Active. What the fuck? Activates active automatically whilst in combat. I could not read that. That that was strange. Also, do, we have three prismatism. We have four prismatism items right now. What the hell's going on? Double the damage against enemies with max HP. We have four prismatism items right now. Distribution mod is going crazy. I don't know what's going on with it. It's doing its thing. Ow. The fire deals with most things. Ow, I got hit twice there, god damn it. It's just because I can't really see much because of all the fire. Oh shit, he hit the barrel. Apparently, setting the fire underneath these boxes does not de detonate the bombs within them. Oh my god, I'm getting hit so much because I can't fucking see. When will this room be over? Holy. Mimic. And we get void chest. I can't remember how void chest works now. A bottomless chest throwing things into it seems like a waste. It activates it automatically during combat. Is that going to be a problem for me? Is that going to be a problem? Seems like that's going to be an issue. Oh, bugger. Okay, everything die fire the burning flames and embers. Got a Sinagrace in here. I would like some better weaponry. My weaponry right now is pretty trash. How much do you cost? 57? I've only got 44. It's not, not really the sort of amazing extra weapon I was hoping for. I'll be honest. Most of those were just explosives. Great. Fair enough. Apparently there's more to this floor. Hello? Nah, I'll leave that for now. Cinegrace, I might come back for you. I doubt it, though. Um, let's get our glacier out. Okay, the glacier can still destroy shots on occasion. It's just not with every shot now, like it used to be. It used to be the powerhouse of boss killing. Like, it wasn't all that strong damage-wise. And it did, didn't it used to be B tier as well, rather than A tier? He upped the tier and weakened the gun. It's still good enough, though, but as you can see, the actual damage it's putting out isn't all that good. That fucking mine did not hit me. Bullshit, it did. Dude, 
how many of those you want to throw at me? Calm down. Oh my god. Taking a lot of damage again. I'm out of ammo again. I took a lot of damage there. That was not very good. I did get a lot of my health back though, which is nice. Oh, we got another piece of trash gun. Go away with all these trash guns. What is this run? It's like, oh, you can have all the passive synergies you can possibly hope for. Here's some absolute garbage to use it with. Our guns are trash. <laughs> the Frost Giant is pretty bad now. The bow is awful. This plasma rifle is pretty terrible. The, the builder gun's bad. The 38 special is terrible. And that covers all of them. <laughs> there is nothing redeemable. Oh, really? I walked right into that. Quite literally. Whoa, what the hell's going on here? Oh, it's the sniper shots. I forgot about these. That's really cool. I like that trap. Burn, son of a bitch. Golden casing? Hell yeah. I don't know where or why you came from, but I'll accept. We need that uh, item that makes burning deal double damage. Ah, fuck it. I can't fucking see anything. This gasoline item's annoying. It's like good because it does a lot of damage, but I just can't see a single thing. And at least it makes us fire immune. If it didn't, then we'd really have a problem. Oh my god, I keep getting hit. It turns out that just... Uh, turbo mode is just really hard once you get to like the fourth and fifth floors. I saw you over there, buddy. Want that armor. Apparently, oh, okay, I was gonna say, apparently there's more enemies in here. There is some ammo in here somewhere also. Oh, there it is. Guess I'll just take it for this, because I don't have anything better. What we got in here? Jam idol. Didn't give us any synergies. Does it? I wonder if it works with modded items. I don't think it does. Oh no, because it works with gasoline. Hmm, maybe that. Maybe there's just a lot of passive items that don't have synergies, which is sad for, for our current use case. This is like the worst sh showcase of this item ever. <laughs> like we're not getting anything out of it really. Uh, also, yeah, my active item just used during combat and uh, sucked up the ammo that I kind of wanted. What on earth is that noise? Oh, it's you. Hello. To the nether realm with you. Is this another gun that's going to be no use to me? Oh, good. A brown chest. I mean... Oh, wait. What the fuck? Didn't mean to do that. It reset my uh, void chest upon dropping it. Even though on the floor it appeared to be as full as when I left it. No, no, no. It's not so easy. I don't know what the fuck's going on right now. This gun's cool, but it's got 101 ammo. That is not enough.
I can't. I can't do this challenge. I don't have anything good enough to, to handle it. This run depresses me deeply. It could have been something so good, and it's just not. <laughs> We've just been dealt the shittiest of shit hands. We got one good passive item. Uh, and that's literally trigger fingers. <laughs> Everything else is just not doing anything for us. I don't, I, I, I don't even know what I was looking at then. Oh, shit. I forgot freezing this guy bugs him the fuck out. Yeah, I forgot that freezing this guy causes him to glitch out really bad. There's binary gun in a boss killer. In a boss killer. Ooh, that was close. Doesn't have any synergies. This thing. I really want to showcase it. It seems like a really, really cool idea for a gun that gives you all passive synergies. And it just ain't giving us anything. And I'm not sure if that's to do with the item or just for the fact that everything we pick up doesn't have synergies. But I really wish that this um, wonderful item and this wonderful run would have provided us with anything of use. Our passive items are trash. Our guns are trash. <laughs> Just, oh, all round the, the spaghetti is depressed. The spaghetti is depressed. It's big sad times. Big sad times. Yeah, damn it. Anyways, we continue on regardless. I have a ton of messages from someone. One second. One second. Okay, we're back. And to cap off the hot mess that is this run, I have pretty much run out of time. <laughs> I thought I had more time to record. I do not. Although, oh god. I don't know if it's going to be an issue because I'll probably end up dying anyways. Right. Holy, there's a jammed guy? Okay, it doesn't matter. There was a jammed guy. He walked into the uh, into the fiery pits of hell. Ooh, ah, god. <laughs> I didn't even fucking see that thing. Oh, I'm out of hammer. I'm out of hammer. God damn it. This one's so trash. Okay. Oh, god, he's jammed. Oh, no. <laughs> Does look, like I said, it doesn't matter. I'm going to be dead anyways. What the hell? This guy's on crack. This guy is on crack. I'm not really sure what the point in this is. Oh god! No! No! There's so many gems! So many gems. I don't wanna die. I don't wanna die. Holy hell. Ooh. Oh god. I'm actually stressing so hard right now. <laughs> the game got so much harder, and it's just because I can't fucking kill anything. Nothing's dying. Oh, there you are, spectral cat. No, no, no. Oh god, this. Yeah. Doesn't matter. Oh my lord. Anyways, <laughs> that was a dumpster fire of a run. It really was. That run had so much potential, and it was so trash. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.